So I come to tell you he's alive, to tell you that he dries every tear that falls. Hey everybody, this is Clint Louie coming to us with Five Minutes from Friendship. When will the rapture take place? When does the rapture take place? Now that is a very good question. And it's one that deserves a good, thorough, biblical answer. When does the rapture take place? I guess it would also help us to ask this question too. What exactly is the rapture? What is the rapture? Well, the Bible tells us in 1 Thessalonians 4, verses 16 and 17, For the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel and with the trump of God, and the dead in Christ shall rise first. Then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up. Listen to those two words now, caught up. They should be, we should be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. And so shall we ever be with the Lord. Now that's 1 Thessalonians 4, verses 16 and 17. Those words caught up. That's where we get this word, this idea, rapture from. Rapture, caught up. It's a snatching away, a catching away. What is the rapture? It's when the Lord Jesus catches his church out of this earth. When he takes his church out. In other words, when he takes the believers out of this earth to go be with him in heaven. As the Bible says, to meet the Lord in the air and so shall we ever be with the Lord. Now that is what the rapture is. But what or when does the rapture happen? When does the rapture happen? Now that's the question. What is the next event on God's prophetic calendar? Well, we need a good thorough Bible answer. The Bible says in 1 Thessalonians 5 and verse 9, For God hath not appointed us to wrath, but to obtain salvation by our Lord Jesus Christ. God hath not appointed us to wrath. Isn't that wonderful? You see, God's people are not looking for the wrath of the tribulation, but we are looking for the Lord to appear. Now, there are people who have the idea that the rapture happens maybe during the tribulation or after the tribulation, but no, the Bible says God hath not appointed us to wrath. The rapture happens before the tribulation. In the Word of God, in the book of Jeremiah, the tribulation is referred to as a time of Jacob's trouble. The tribulation, that seven-year prophetic period on the earth, has to do with Israel. Now, God's going to deal with the whole world, but especially with Israel as he's bringing the Jews, his chosen people, as he's bringing the Jews back to himself, and they come to believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, whom they crucified. And the Bible teaches us that the tribulation, it has to do with Israel. So before that begins, God's going to take his church out of this world. Now understand, please, that we should believe in a literal interpretation of Scripture, not allegories, not mysticism, not whatever I think it means or what it means to me and what it means to you. No, 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 no. The Bible means what it means, and it says what it says. And if you take a literal interpretation of Scripture, then you have to believe what this book says about the rapture taking place before the tribulation. Also, if we follow what the scripture says in 1 Corinthians chapter 10 and verse number 32, 1 Corinthians 10, 32, then we understand that there is a, there is a complete difference between the church and Israel. Those are two separate bodies, two separate groups, the church and Israel, two totally separate groups. And when we understand that and we believe that, then we also come to realize that the tribulation, it's God dealing with the Jews, with Israel. And so what happens to the church? Well, the church is taken out of this earth. And one more thing about the tribulation being after the rapture is that you do not find the church anywhere between Revelation chapter 4 and chapter 18. You don't find it anywhere between chapters 4 through chapter 18. You don't. You find the church mentioned in chapters 1, 2, and 3, and then you find those saved people mentioned in 19 following, but as far as on the earth, 
during the tribulation, between chapters 4 through chapter 19, you don't find the church mentioned. And so, you know, that tells me something. That tells me that the church won't be on this earth when the tribulation is unfolded because the rapture takes place before. So the rapture happens before the tribulation. I just wanted to share a word with you and I hope you have a great day.